Hello everyone, my name is Mad Radio DX UK and I want to welcome you to this video which is showing the updated parts for flashing the firmware on the TEF6686. Now the firmware that's um, the latest at the moment is uh, version 2.00.x meaning that's going to be version 2.00.1.2 etc. Now the process has uh, changed slightly from the um, firmware that I showed on the uh, tutorial video and um, that was the previous version 2 um, firmware so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to show you the updated parts only from the tutorial video I'm not going to do um, upload a whole new um, tutorial video for this uh, new firmware because what it is is that um, they seem to be changing the way the uh, firmware is flashed um, you know so there could be you know after I've done this video when they do you know release another firmware version the probably the process will be changed again and that means I'm gonna have to do another new video um, showing how to flash the firmware so what it is is that um, the the fundamental way of uh, flashing the firmware is still the same pretty much the same um, it's just the following parts that uh, will be different so this video updates the following from the original tutorial video at 7 minutes and 10 seconds on the original tutorial video um, the process of uh, downloading the 2.0 beta firmware I will show you the new location on the disk group where to download the firmware and at 12 minutes 25 seconds on the original video flashing the TEF to 2.0 beta again um, the uh, again the process of flashing the firmware on the new uh, 2.0 um, firmware versions has changed. The rest of the original tutorial video applies. Only the above timeline parts mentioned is being replaced by the following updates. So what we're going to do is we're going to show the uh, process of how to download the uh, new 2.0 uh, firmware version for the TEF6686. Okay, so what we have to do is we have to go into the TEF Discord group Go on the left hand side tab here and go to the part that says S Jeff's projects and then go to the part here that says updates. OK, now I recommend uh, downloading the following version because it's the most stable. Um, it's this one here, version 2.00.1 from the 30th of December 2023. So what we do is we click on this one, this link here. Continue to download. And there the uh, new firmware version or the most stable one um, as of this date at the moment of uh, doing this video has been downloaded and then next what we do is we go to our download location where um, we downloaded our new TEF6686 firmware we double clicked on the zipped uh, file with the firmware on it and then what we do is we drag the folder onto our desktop okay so we're just going to close those two windows and there we are okay with our folder here with the tf6686 files in it we're going to double click on it and what we have to do is we have to go into the flash file double click that uh, the flash file that we see here okay so we're going to double click on it right and of course we have to find out the uh, com port number we've done it already remember to look at the original tutorial video i know it's number five so i'm gonna i'm gonna press enter and it says here does your radio have a boot button to flash the radio yes press y enter and here it says switch on the radio while holding the boot but uh, button and press any key so we're just going to put the screwdriver inside the headphone socket to access the boot button and we're going to switch on the radio and the display should be blank like so okay and then after that says press any key after we've uh, put the radio into the boot mode okay so press any key formatting file system all right and just leave it as it is don't touch anything and do, do not disconnect the tef radio okay so now the next uh, instruction it's asking us to do is to uh, now switch your radio off and back on so i'm going to switch the radio off and i'm going to switch it back on and then you should see the following here formatting file system okay and it tells you on screen when you see the message formatting uh, finished on your radio switch off the radio okay so now it's appeared that you see it there formatting finished okay and then what we do 
is uh, we're going to switch off the radio. And the next instruction that you see here uh, is next switch your radio on while holding the boot button and press any key. So we repeat that process again of putting the radio into boot mode. Uh, the uh, screw into, into the uh, headphone socket to access the boot button. Okay. Rather the screwdriver into the headphone socket, sorry. So there we go. Switch on the radio. And again, the display should be blank. Okay. There we are. Okay, and then the next thing we have to do is like it says on screen, press any key. We do that, uploading software. And again, we leave everything as it is. Do not uh, switch off the radio, do not disconnect anything. And it's gonna take a little while. It, the process, this process takes longer than the uh, original firmware version or rather the other firmware version that I showed on the uh, original tutorial video. Okay, again, taking longer than the tutorial video process. And that's it. Update completed and press any key to close this program. So once the flashing process has uh, been completed, we can disconnect the USB connection to our TEF6686. We'll switch off the radio. We'll switch it uh, back on. Okay, and it's asking to restart the tuner, so we just switch it off. Again, switch it back on. Again, this uh, uh, method of uh, restarting the tuner after doing the firmware flash, um, that's also the same on the uh, original tutorial video. And again, there we go, All right? Our firmware, new firmware has been flashed successfully on our TF6686. Uh, so that's how to flash the firmware uh, process, the updated uh, parts. Um, for the new firmware version 2.00.x um, and uh, this one like I said it's for the uh, firmware version 2.00.1 um, um, because uh, like I said that's the most stable version at the moment thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in another video